Hello there, here we are with Mr. Nevin, Nevin McGuire here with his nation's favourite healthy food, new book, uh, just launched. I got all very <laughs> excited, we've got all the food hidden out here, we've been eating for the last hour, it's fantastic. Um, a pleasure to have you here. Thank you so much. We're just going to say, book number 12. I know, I can't believe it. Wow, like in, in dog years, that's like, what, what how old are we now? Like, that's, that's you know what, we've been through the journey together. We've <laughs> ate every book at this stage, <laughs> and I'm, I'm glad we finally got healthy, because you know what, this, you know, we have to sort that out. But uh, it's fantastic. So, um, one thing for me I'm always fascinated with, with chefs, and literary chefs, is um, what makes you decide the next topic? Like, um, where did healthy come from? What made you go for that? I suppose there's two answers to it because, first of all, oh, with Kieran McMillan, they have a great team. So yeah. Nikki Howard, we put our head together, our team. Yeah. What's going to be? What's going to be new? What do people want? Yeah. For me, it's about what people want when they're at demonstrations. They want to eat healthier yeah. and bring them along gradually. This is not a diet book. Yeah. This is a book that all the family can eat well and eat seasonally and just enjoy good food and full of flavour. It was educational for me yeah. because I, I certainly, you know me, me cream and me butter and different yes. things like that on the TV show. So this is worth a dream. Yes. Myself and all my team, we tested every single recipe in the cookery school. So I know they're delicious, I know they work, yeah. and I'm absolutely delighted with it. Fantastic. Yeah, because I was looking through it and it's it's one of those, it's, it's kind of 50% what you kind of ex expect but looks gorgeous and it's it's easy to get. Sometimes it's like, yes, you go down to the small market that nobody can get to, and, but it seems like it's stuff you can just literally whip up or grab. But then there's kind of, not risque, but kind of a bit more adventurous, but still looks beautiful. And yeah, nice. there, there's a little bit, there's something for everyone in this. Yeah, a real kind of family cookbook that they yeah. can all enjoy the journey together. Uh, good food and healthy food is all about eating seasoning, you know, cooking it simply and fast. Yeah. All these recipes are very, very quick to make, which is yeah. very important. Well, that's the thing. I'm, I'm, I'm going to hands up here. I'm a three minute ping man. This is a disaster. I, I'm, but if, this, if ever one man's going to get me to cook, it's this man. And I looked at this and went, you know, this is the year. After year 12. 12 books. After 12 books. This is the one, but we'll see. I love it. Yeah, book 13, I'll be like, no. Anyway, but, um, so, back in your youth, um, I, 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 I this image of you kind of, Pushing your mom out of the way in the kitchen, going here. I'll do this. Um, I'm no Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> so, what is like? Was it your love of food, or was it your love of, of the whole kind of theatre of making food that, that you loved? As I, I suppose a bit of both. From the age of twelve, I just really enjoyed kind of experimenting and chopping and different yeah. things like that. My mother gave me the great the basics. You know, I do a proper roast, and yeah. you know, how do you, if you get the basics right, then you can cook yeah. some beautiful food. Yeah. And like, you know, you can give the same uh, people the same five ingredients, and they'll all cook something different. So being creative and traveling, and, and I mean, like, I I've seen huge changes in food in Ireland. It's a great time to be in food. Yeah. We have great chefs. We have wonderful produce. We've always had wonderful produce, yeah. and now there's a great buzz. People are very interested. More and more people are cooking at home. So they want to enjoy and, and maybe eat together as a family, yeah. bring cook for their family and friends, yeah. and that's wonderful. So Brilliant. And it is, as you said earlier, the speed thing, it's, it's, yeah. it's not a four hour slog, or it is, no way. you do something and then you walk off, and walk, but it, it's, it's, you know, it's a much quicker and easier way to, because people these days, time is more. Yeah. Well it has to be, you know, you're right, because people's time is, is valuable yeah. and they're working, so they yeah. want something that they can, from start to finish in 30, 40 minutes, yeah. and stuff that you can make ahead and freeze. That's really yeah. important. Brilliant. Now, as I, I've looked through it, I'm going to call you on one. Oh, there's God, there's, there's 99 that, yeah, I can see where the healthy is there, and then I saw one, and of course it's the one that I love. Which but one? I don't believe, Which one? I don't believe that it's healthy, right? And I'd like to find out it's in the kids' menu, of course, I didn't even look. And it's the peanut butter and banana French toast sandwich. Now, now that's healthy. Look at all the lovely seeds in the bread. Peanut butter is good for you that's in moderation. Right. That's okay. what I hear, yeah. And then, of course, your banana is full of potassium. That's it. So it's a very, very simple. Is that one you're going to that's try? That's the one. There we go. I'm going to live off that for the next year. See how we get on the new peanut butter diet. But uh, absolutely fantastic. So the book is out now. It's going to be a massive best out of Christmas. We're so. all very excited. Uh, absolute pleasure to have you in. Listen, and can I just thank you and the whole team for me since like from day one when I started writing books, you were 110% behind me. Yeah. So on my, my behalf, yeah. thank you. I'm well, a minute. I'm privileged. 12 cookbooks. Oh, God. You've seen the way I've aged. Oh, I, I well, backwards. He's going backwards. Listen, <laughs> pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys.